this is a fine line because losing in the Super Bowl can define you in a really poor way. The Seahawks have not gotten back since. But I think where the benefit lies with last night is there's not some crushing, terrible decision or collapse. Like the Falcons had to wear that and they couldn't shake it. Losing 28-3, to could not shake it. Emotionally couldn't shake it. The Seahawks losing that way, Marshawn Lynch not getting the football, Malcolm Butler interception, couldn't shake it. Emotionally could not shake it. I don't think the Chiefs will have a tough time shaking this one because they were blown out. It wasn't a collapse. It wasn't a calamity. It wasn't some type of disastrous mistake or play call. It was they just played like crap last night, and they got owned. And that is a wake-up call instead of a devastation. So I think this can help them, and and I think that every dynasty – They may become that. They may not. I I don't know. I'm not guaranteeing that. But I think if they do become that, every dynasty has to have some get over the hump, some type of reflection. You know, nobody nobody just rattled off four or five championships in a row and then, you know, that was it. The Steelers, they had, they lost in the playoffs year after year. Franco has the immaculate reception. They don't win the Super Bowl at 72. They end up losing to the Dolphins of the playoffs. They end up losing again in the playoffs in 73. Everybody thinks that Immaculate Reception ended up just starting the dynasty. They were still two years away. And even in between 76, 77, they ran into an awesome Raiders team, had tons of injuries. They they had to reset themselves for the second two. The Niners, it wasn't four in a row. They were headed some terrible playoff beatdowns. The Giants beat them 49 to 3 in 86. The Bears embarrassed them in 85 or 84, forget. I guess they won in 84, but there was the beatdown in 87 against the Vikings. They were a 13 point favorite and they lose to the Vikings. They are embarrassed. People are saying that Bill Walsh needs to retire. They had to reboot themselves for 88 and 89. You know, that that Cowboys team lost in 94 in the NFC Championship game to the Cowboys, to the Niners, rather, to reboot for 95. That Patriots team, they won 01, 03, and 04. They missed the playoffs in 02. And there was a 10-year gap between them winning another Super Bowl after 04. 10 years. where They, they got handed painful losses in Super Bowls. Painful losses in championship games of the playoffs. They had to they had to overcome those moments. So I think the Chiefs, if you're going to build something that's sustainable and you're there all the time and you win multiple Super Bowls, I think you do need to go through some heartache. And the Chiefs really hadn't had that much since Mahomes took over, where they really had to do soul searching. And now they got to do it. And I think that's important. I think that's that could be a good thing. 